Doja Cat breaks her silence on her drama with Cardi B. Bad Baby reacts to getting a tattoo with NBA Youngboy's name on it. Plus, it seems like the Cardi B-Nicki Minaj feud is never gonna end. Hey guys, it's Lisa Braun for Hollywood Life with your hip hop roundup, starting with Travis Scott. He just surprised fans by announcing his new Netflix documentary called A Look Mom, I Can Fly. He posted a series of photos on Instagram showing VHS tapes captioned Meet Me Here Netflix and No Chill with an address in Houston. You'll be able to watch the documentary on August 28th, so mark your calendars, people. Moving on to the Nicki Minaj Cardi B T that you all love slash hate. This time, the drama started after Cardi's main girl, Starbrim, was on the Keeping Up Blue podcast. She said there's no way she would let Raw Ali hit Cardi in the head with a shoe if she were at that infamous New York Fashion Week party. She also said if she sees Nicki's friends, she's going after them. Well, Raw Ali quickly heard what Star said. TMZ reports, quote, she feels it's just a poor attempt by Star to get her 15 minutes of fame. And instead of worrying about last year's fight, Star should be asking why she's still dancing for dollars while her friend Cardi lives lavishly. Ooh. Moving on to Bad Baby, she recently showed off her new tattoo, which reads Kentrell. Now here's the T, that's NBA Youngboy's legal first name, and I hope I said it right. He's also in a relationship with another girl. So as you can imagine, Danielle received tons of backlash, but she addressed it all on an Instagram Live. The tattoo has been there for a while now. I just decided to get it redone. Y'all don't know nothing. It's so crazy. All I see on the internet, people talk and talk and talk. This is my body. These are my tattoos. I do my own for my own reasons. Y'all do not know what goes on behind with the me and him. Y'all don't know behind the scenes, so please. Stop telling me how he has a girlfriend. I did not get this tattoo to be with him or because I'm with him. Like, come on, stop. Moving on to Doja Cat. A few weeks ago, she posted a video of herself singing along to Cardi B's track, Press. And it seems like she's mocking Cardi. This song is so fuego, but like, ding dong, your girl, it's your girl Cardi B. Yeah. I want to laugh, but I also don't want to be on Cardi's bad side. Anyway, Cardi responded to Doja's video in a now deleted post saying, do anything for clout, moo. Doja has since apologized and actually just spoke about it again on Big Boy TV. Listen to what she has to say. But I had this thing called Celsius, mm -hmm. and it's like 250 milligrams of caffeine. I've never been that hyper, I think, in my entire life. Mm -hmm. And I was super excited, and I had the radio on, and then her song came on, and I was, like I do with myself and everybody else, making fun of, you know, the, the song. Mm -hmm. But it's a dope song. I acknowledge that as well. And people uh, edited out the parts where I was acknowledging it that it was... That it was great. I spoke to Cardi and she was really sweet. Yeah. And understanding. And, yeah, man. And like she is. She's a smart. She's a smart woman. And uh, and I feel like she makes. She probably makes fun of her friends and and other celebrities. You know, she's that's just too. something you do when you're when you're either hopped up on caffeine yeah. or you're lit. You know <laughs> what I mean? I feel like you can't make fun of anyone unless you're a comedian, which I'm not. So. I'm gonna go. A few minutes later. But alright guys, hit the sub, like, and bell button for the latest celebrity news. And if you want to follow me on social media, you can. I'm Bron LA. Have a good weekend. Bye.